Yeah, hello everybody and welcome back. So we'll be continuing with our previous classes and we'll be creating a new table and we'll be doing a, a relation on this table. So in the previous class we have created a, a price table and we have created a, a relation between a price and a product. So in this video uh, we'll be creating a, a unit uh, table and uh, we'll be doing a relationship with the product table. So let's create a new table. And let's create a new table. And we'll provide a name as a key unit. And the label we'll be providing as a Unit of measure. This so label will provide us a unit of measure. And let's just add a few fields. One will be a string. And a string name I will give as a Item ID. Okay, and this is create another uh, string uh, unit. Okay. So let's just uh, create a two field first for our unit, and item should be match with our item ID right, so it's a 15 string size so we will also create this one to 15 okay so just save it save the project and restore it and uh, now we will be creating a relationship between our uh, unit and our product table so, okay so let's create a new relation Create a new relation and just provide a table name first. Uh, product table, All right? So uh, I will be creating a new uh, field over here, normal, uh, normal relation, and we'll be uh, setting the field for our relation. So the related field will be item and the related field will be uh, item ID. Right? So the field we are selecting is uh, item item ID from the unit is linked to uh, item ID from our uh, product table. Save it and now let's just go and open our table and we will add a new field. So we have a relation of our table and it is made as the piece and let's else add a same item and we can also create as a two We have uh, two uh, two units for same item. Now we can see that we have a uh, uh, item uh, uh, product price data unit power uh, project. So we have a project suit table and we have also created a uh, relation between uh, this table. So this is a child table, our unit, and our master table will be a, or a parent table will be our product. So this child table is related to a uh, product table. So uh, this was for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed this one, and we will be continuing with our lesson on our uh, next classes. Uh, thank you, and thank you for watching.